Hey, good morning. This is Ray here at Namrag Farms. Hope you're having another beautiful day. It's it's a gorgeous one, although from my perspective, maybe a little cloudy. From his perspective, it's perfect. This past weekend, we uh, were blessed and honored to have the whole shoe family from Ohio drop by the farm and hang out for a while. And uh, uh, the whole shoes, they have three sons, Nate, Zach, and Josh. And, and Zach came out and Zach's rambunctious and he wanted to herd the sheep in. He won't do this. He's 17 years old. So he literally took off running through the field. The sheep were down there and he actually got them in. He herded them in. Uh, his mom took a video of it. It's quite fun to watch. But there was something else that, uh, that Zach did. I told Zach, I said, Zach, go grab that sheep and pick that sheep up and set it on its rear end. And, well, you know, so we can trim some hooves and, and Zach tried and he, <laughs> we got a video of that too. He's giving his all. He just didn't know what he was doing. And I walked up, grabbed the sheep, set her right up on her rear end and said, that's how you do it. And then it hit me. How many times in my life have I tried to do something for the shepherd, not knowing what I was doing? And I didn't stop and ask, can you teach me how to do this? Can you show me how to do this? I didn't stop and inquire of the Lord. And so through Zach in that little moment with him, I was blessed to listen once again, to know that, you know, if there's something in life that I sense that needs to be done, before I just jump in and try to do it on my own, I need to stop and ask the Good Shepherd, please teach me how. Otherwise, I will just stir up the sheep and I will just trouble the sheep because I don't know exactly what he wants. I don't know exactly how to do what needs to be done, but he does. So today I want to encourage you. If there's something in your life that you sense needs to be done, stop, ask, and listen. Now go enjoy the shepherd. I'll see you soon.